fortuitously in navigating Serenity. Darren and I flew to Costa Rica. We landed in Liberia and headed off to Playa del Coco, where I got my dive certification with a local dive shop, Somersault Dive Center. Now we are off to explore Monteverde and the Cloud Forest. We got a ride up to Monteverde on Interbus, a transit service in Costa Rica that we found was very easy to use and quickly became our favorite way to travel across the country. Once Dara and I arrived in Monteverde, we jumped on a city-style bus and we had a very interesting ride from the town out to the cloud forest. What a spectacular place. The forest was thick and dense, but there was a well-worn path that made it easy going. We kept hearing the strange bird call that echoed throughout the forest. It sounded like screeching metal, a sound that proved very difficult to capture on video properly. We later discovered that this was a three-waddled bellbird, and that they are very shy and difficult to spot, in fact, rare. Darren and I climbed up the forest path until we reached the top. And wow, what a spectacular view over the top of the forest canopy. Absolutely beautiful. After a long day in the forest, one more crazy bus ride, and we are back to town. We went to check out some of the cool, neat shops, and found what I'd have to say is arguably one of the biggest avocados I'd ever seen. It was pretty tasty, too. We looked for a place to eat, and we found this really cool restaurant with a tree growing up out of the center. So we decided to go check it out. We wandered around town for a little while, but then it was time to head back to our hotel. We needed to make sure we got our rest because we had another fun-filled day planned ahead. 
While we were waiting in line to begin, we spotted this green little owl perched right above us on the tree branch. He was quite difficult to spot though and he blended in very well. This was actually Dara's first time on zip lines, and she was a little apprehensive at first. We chose the Zipline Park 100% Adventura because, for one major point, they claimed to have a two kilometer long zipline that went from mountaintop to mountaintop. This sounded exciting. They had lines, bridges, drops, and swings. We had a blast. Two kilometer Superman zip line did not disappoint. Truly spectacular.
Then for the final test of courage, the Tarzan Jungle Swing, where you get to jump off a suspended platform and swing out over the canopy. <laughs> You've done good so far. For a minute there, I didn't think you were going to do the Superman. <laughs> Sorry guys. No, 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 it's alright. Kind of cringe. How far down? It's like, I thought I was going to be further. Yeah. But, um, I just started thinking about it too much. <laughs> <laughs> I did a lot of screaming on the way down. <laughs> yeah. He did that on purpose though. Yeah, he did. Go for it, Dara. There's quite a few. <laughs> yeah. It is a pretty crazy deal, so. Oh my god, you did it. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>